So lost. Yes, yes. Just like you. What do you, what do you want? Huh? You need me to tell you the way? Huh? Oh, you're still there. Well, once upon a time. Home at time. Was a time. There was, there was a, student a student who was lost. lost. Yes. Lost. lost. Like you are now. now. And there was, there was a portrait. A portrait. Who? Who couldn't help? must be quite fascinated with what you are seeing for the first time. Yes, a bunch of moving, talking, portraits. Yes. Yes, we are, you are very, we are very, very important people. Yes, that's why we have our own paintings. You? Well, who knows? Maybe you will become someone big, some, some, someone important, and then you will get your own painting here. I find that a little hard to believe. You see, you are already lost, and it's your first day. The only thing you had to do. Was to follow the other students, to follow your house prefect. Yes, he was leading the way. All right, all right, all right. Calm down, okay. Let me see what I can do to help you. If I can find the way to where you want to go, okay. Let's begin with something like this. Once upon a time, once upon a time, a student wanted to find a way to his common room, and he, oh, you are wondering why I'm reading this, well, yes, it's a, it's a book with everything that has ever happened and will ever happen in the future. So I'm trying to find the page in which we are right now. Oh yes, this is it, yes. I, sw I swear to you, even as a portrait, I haven't lost my allergies, which is very, very cruel. Just a second. Don't 
Don't worry, I'm gonna find it again. It was somewhere around here. Just a second. Oh, here it is. Once there was a student who was lost and found himself talking to a very, very glorious portrait of a very, very powerful and famous wizard. Yeah, uh, I may have added a few things. Let's see what happens. The student asks for help and unfortunately, the portrait doesn't know the way. Tells him to go go left, and then with the time, time he finds find other other portraits, portraits knowing the exact exactly way, way, way he must go go. Well, the book always tells the truth. You should go left. Yes, left. And you're going to find other portraits, I guess, as it says here, and you will find your way. Well, I wish you a lot of luck. Luck, luck. And who knows, maybe one day you might become a famous person. And we'll have your own place here with us. Yes. Well, you'll need to die first. But don't worry about that. No. It's, we're talking about something for 80, 90 years forward in time. Yes. So, go on. I hope you find your way. Goodbye. for someone or something in particular. You look a little bit lost, if I do say so myself. Ah, okay, right. Let me uh, think a minute where that is, hold on. Okay, so you've got to go up the stairs, up, 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 okay. And then it is your first door on the left. Or it could be on the right. I can't remember, but you'll find out when you get there. <laughs> oh, wait, wait up. Um, why don't we just spend a little bit of time together? It won't take too much of your time. I just, I get a little bit lonely, you know. It'd be nice for someone to, well, chat with me. <laughs> Keep me company. <laughs> okay, so let, let me, me show, show you a few things. My name. <laughs> Sorry, that's a kind of top secret. If I had to tell you my name, I'd have to kill you. We both wouldn't want that now. Anyway, let me show you a few things. The first is my brand new magic notebook. Yeah, yeah. a magic, magic notebook. notebook. So basically, you write your notes in it, and it's magical. <laughs> A really pretty book. And it says a message on the front. It says, Beware those who seek the secrets that lie within. 
And we've all got secrets now, haven't we? I know I have. Anyway, yes, it's uh, a magical notebook. Also, I have a brand new magic wand. Oh yeah. <laughs> this is a sought after wand. Let me tell you now. Okay, I won't turn you into a frog. Not now, anyway. <laughs> and also, I've got a magic bottle. Now, this just looks like a normal bottle to you, yeah? But if you wait a second, I'll do something very magical. <laughs> and now it is a light. I thought it was impressive anyway. Okay, I know you are in a rush to go, and I understand that, but I just want you to say hello to my little friend here. Come on. <laughs> it's okay, he, he won't buy it. Well, I don't think he'll buy it anyway. <laughs> yes, he's a good boy. He's a good boy. <laughs> Off you go.
Hello. What's up? I wasn't talking to my wand. It's none of your business anyway, even if I was. Okay, um, you need some directions or something. Figures. Always getting uh, lost students walking around here. But I do ask for something in return though. Something um, usually valuable or just anything really. So uh, empty your pockets please. Really? He's magic. I'm not getting any sparkliness from him. It's unusual for a magic item. Okay, well, I'll take it anyway. Okay, um, I don't actually really know where it is you want to go. I'm just a portrait and uh, I don't really wander the halls. Um, no, it's okay, I can tell you. I can tell you really, it's fine. I know where to go, just don't leave please. It's been a while since I've had someone to talk to. Let me show you a really cool magic trick, okay? I'm gonna make my wand light up like you won't believe, you know? So, um, I just need to remember the spell. Uh, remember the spell, okay. Um, uh, so, what's it go? Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Abracadabronius. You have to say it in a Scottish accent as well, because otherwise it won't work. And um, I'm aware that didn't work. Ready, ready, ready. Abracadabronius. <gasps> Look at it. See the sparkles. It's just magic, isn't it? <sighs> oh, come back. Oh. It's been on the fritz lately. I've been doing all sorts. I've been. Oh, I did this the other day. Oh, probably shouldn't do it and turn my head into that of a frog's. On the plus side, I had some riveting conversation with people. <laughs> okay, um... So, what brings you around here anyway? Well, I know you're students, but... <laughs> what, you know, what makes you so special? I mean, I look at you now and I see... <laughs> I see me when I was young. Except I was special. I had, you know, really amazing abilities to do some incredible things. I mean, I had a better wand than this one to start with. Um, I had a really good one. Really strong, really powerful. Could do some incredible things. But you wake up one day... Finding, find yourself applying for a job as a painting. Just kidding, that's not really how it works. God, you're such an idiot. <laughs> Please don't leave. No, don't go, it's fine. I can, I can tell you, I can tell you where to go. But first, um, just watch this. Okay, you ready? Can you stop fritzing on me, please? <sighs> it does this on occasion, just kind of fizzles out, fizzles in. Let me begin. <sighs> okay. Can you feel yourself getting sleepy? I'm not trying to make you sleepy on purpose, no. Um... Not at all, I just, uh, you know, just thought maybe you might want to just stare at the wand for a little while. 
maybe your eyes start getting a little bit heavy, you know, it's up to you. And then maybe you forget about the fact that I can't tell you where to go. Um, I don't know where, where to go or where you should go. Um, I know where I can go, I'm stuck in this place. Oh god, I'm making myself sleepy. <laughs> Wakiest, shakiest. Oh, dang. Okay, it's fine. I gave myself a, a burst of energy then. Okay, so. Anyway, so just. fingers. Aren't they relaxing? What? You want your dog back? Um, no. But let me show you a few things I've collected along the way. You're not having any of these either, but it might take your mind off the dog. <laughs> right, I have, look at this, this has been my mascot for years. She's been with me from the start. We've been uh, through a lot together. I've turned her into all sorts. She started off as a, as a little snake. But I don't like snakes that much. So I turned her into a bear. And ever since we've been best friends. <laughs> yeah, well, you know. Clear they can't be as funny as you, can we? So maybe you wanna just look at the bear for a bit. Or something, you know, just feel really relaxed and sleepy. Like you're gonna pass out on the stairs and then wake up and I'll be gone out the back somewhere, just away from you. Nope, okay. And what about this guy? No. It's really really fun. Um, quite a hoot, actually. Some uh, poor student gave me this and I just... Yeah, it was back in the old days when I used to just get people to give me stuff and I'd hide, you know, just a casual... And they wouldn't know. They can't. They can't come in here to get me. So I just ducked away. You know, hid. Um, but I'm not like that now. I'd rather make, make them look. Look at me. And look at the look wand. At the wand. And uh, fall asleep. Fall asleep. Still not working? Okay. Let me teach you some spells. So. so. The thing is, yes. I've been working on a few thought control spells. So the one thing that I've really been working on for situations such as this a go, go away, away spell. spell. Let me just see if it works. I might have mastered it. So if you go away after this, I know it's worked. So I've been trying to make up the best sort of words to use. Do not, 
do one Aronis. No. Okay. You have to add some kind of onus or onus on the end of whatever you want to happen. Um, I'll go this one. Get, Get lost, lost Arushis. No. Okay, one more. Bring out the classics now. Pisophagus. Maybe that sounds too much like esophagus, so the spell's getting confused and it doesn't know what it's doing. I hear that can happen sometimes. Relax. Okay. okay. Just feel tired. Pass that on the, on the stairs, stairs and when you wake, wake up, up. I won't be I'll here. Be. I'll, be I'll be having a coffee, coffee or something. Or something. Mm. Ah, maybe I shouldn't tell people what I'm trying to do. Hmm. Interesting. Any chance you can forget what I just said? No. Useless. Absolutely students these days. Just, just terrible. terrible. Are you sleepy? Yeah. I'm not even I'm trying to make you make tired. It's just, just... Seriously, for goodness sake. I managed to make five different students fall asleep, but you're not doing it, are you? Oh, fine. It's down the hall, up the stairs on the left. You're welcome. Lumos. 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 Do come closer. Yes, yes, wonderful. Have I seen you here before? You don't look familiar. Yes, well, I recognise every single person that walks along here. And every ghost. And every magical creature. Well, anyway, it's nice to meet you. My name is Frances. Yes. Well, you know, I have quite a few things to show you. I, I do hope you're not in a hurry. 
Well, I'll show you quickly then. <laughs> you see, I was just working on some potions. And I wanted to show you these two lovely creatures. You see, these two are Lucid Ranai. That means they are shimmering silver frogs. And they are found in Western Australia. And I use their gems for potion making. Now, I must say they are seriously underrated. You wouldn't think it, but, well, I guess it's also because they're quite difficult to come by. And um, the best way to catch them is to sing them a lovely lullaby song. And I was lucky enough to receive such a wonderful gift. Now, the important thing about these lovelies is that you always keep them happily fed and warm and generally happy. Now, their siblings love to give me their gemstones because, well, first of all, they don't need them, but they enjoy giving, sharing. Yet these two are not very fond of sharing and giving. They tend to be quite greedy. So I had to just cast a light sleeping spell onto them so that I could take them without them noticing. But the funny thing is, every time they wake up, they don't even notice that the gemstones are gone. And usually it takes them about a week or two to grow them back, and then everything's back to normal, and then the whole thing starts again. <laughs> but, yeah, don't you think they're beautiful? Oh my goodness. Goodness, goodness, they are so lovely. Do you enjoy making potions? You haven't gotten around to making many yet? Oh, okay. Well, in future you will know that these will definitely come in handy. Now, I'll let them rest for now. <laughs> okay. Oh no, wait, wait, I have more to show you. <laughs> you children are in such a rush these days. Where are you heading to? Oh, okay. All right, well, well, I have some more things I just want to show you, okay? I'm so excited about them, please. Oh, great, okay, it won't take long, I promise. Okay. Right. So. This is the nest of a Testudium parva arvis. Oh, it means it's the nest of a little fox bird. You've seen them flying around here? Yes, so cute, aren't they? Oh, their little chirps in the morning just brighten my day immediately. <laughs> only does this beautiful nest make lovely sounds. Only a few branches of this will actually help you make one of the funnest potions that there ever was. Can you guess? Mm, not quite. They are used for making shrinking potions. They are so much fun. So basically, if you use these, um, well, depending on how much you use, I would always recommend about four to five branches. Yes, if you use four to five branches of this lovely nest, you can shrink to any size you want. You will just have to think it up in your mind and you'll take your wand and then you will lightly touch it like this. As you close your eyes, you will think about the size that you want to be. It can be the size of a mouse, the size of a peanut, the size of a sesame seed, anything. 
and then you let it go again and then you drop it into your cauldron yes I'm sure you'll be learning all about this yes yes throughout the year definitely yeah you learn it pretty early on yeah now usually this potion will last for up to six hours however if you add three tiers of a ghoul you will be able to prolong that experience for at least four to five hours but that's just a little tip you didn't hear it from me <laughs> so I'm sure you'll have lots of fun with that potion you can get up to all sorts of mischief but I of course would never advise that no 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 what would the headmaster say? oh well oh you have to go? oh dear okay well alright then mm. is there anything I can do for you? or do you think you'll be okay? be all right? Okay, perfect. Right. You have a lovely, lovely day, okay? Great. I hope we'll see each other again very soon. Yes, it was very nice talking to you. <laughs> okay. Right. Okay. Have a lovely day then, all right? I'll see you soon. You look like someone who would not be a party pooper. You look like someone who would like to have some fun and not be a tattletale. Okay, that's good. That's good news. Well, as you can see, I'm trapped in a picture frame. And I've been kind of banished. Well, I got into a bit of trouble. They, they don't understand magic the way I do and um, I was banished I'm not allowed to use magic or talk to any other people so that's why I'm here but I can talk to you now and I don't know what the big deal is really I just accidentally burned down City Hall with my magic told them it was an accident, but what are you going to do? It's so stupid. They don't know anything about magic. Honestly, like I've been studying magic for as long as I can remember, and the spells that I use, they sometimes go a little bit weird. It's really strong magic, and I think I'm the only one who can properly use it. Of course, there's a bit of flukes here and there. Um, I think I just need to do a little bit more studying, to be honest. All you wizards out there, out in the real world, 
guys think? You're so good with magic. I've been studying these spells since before it was cool. And I know for a fact that nobody else can cast magic like I can. Let me read you a couple of spells here. for a very long time and I was able to create my own. It's got its flaws but it's really quite something else. Do you want to see what I can do? Okay, well first I have a fire spell. It's one of my favorites. Fire is my start showing you some of my tricks that I can do. Not going quite as planned. But let's just keep trying.
Are you impressed yet? Yes, maybe it's the wrong magic Stick it. 
are not, or not, or not about who I am, child. Worry more about what? Worry more about what I will do to you. <laughs> Have you traveled far? I see you are. You are in this school. You must be gifted. You must know magic. in this school. I see you are in this school. You must know. You must know magic. Maya. Spells. You must have power. You must have power. I like power. I feed on power. Power gives me my strength. My energy. My energy. been with me for a very long time. Longer than you'll ever know. Longer than you'll probably live. Live, live, live. Once he wronged me. And we couldn't have that now, could we? No, we couldn't. We couldn't. We couldn't. And then just like that, poof, he was mine forever. Doing exactly what I said. By my side forever. Never, never, never going to leave me again. But anyways, child, come closer. Come, 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 come closer. Let me have a better look at you. Let me, let me, let me. Come closer, child. Let me have a better look at you. Very well. Very good. Permit me to... Get my wand for a moment. For so I can better inspect you. For so I for so for so I can better inspect you. Inspect you. Inspect you. Thank you very much. Don't mind. Don't mind me at all. So what did you say your name was? Child? Ah yes, that's right. Right now, before you get any silly ideas, I'm not a fairy godmother. I'm not going to be bibbity bubbity boop. I'm not going to be doing those bibbity bubbity boop spells on you. Okay. No, no, no. I'm a far, 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 far more evil, malicious, nasty kind of witch. Some would say I'm evil down to the very, very core of my soul. <laughs> but being bad is so much more fun. Wouldn't you agree? Agree. Agree. You wouldn't? Well, you should. I have an idea. I will make it so that you agree that being bad is good. Okay.
do want to learn more. seem to be lost and you look tired well come a bit closer you look tired exhausted a bit so what do you think to spend some time together way, of course I can, but I have something that you hurt yourself. What happened? You need to just come with me and get some healing things in my home. You want to? Don't be scared, take good care of you. Just rest. You must be so tired. Welcome at my place. I think you need to calm down a bit and I make you like get to another place and forget about your pain because I try to heal you, okay? Now sit back and relax with me. I will prepare a potion I should book. This book is for dreams and potions, so I know how to bring you to another place. Find 
this was new. Let me find it. Let me find it. Where is it? Oh, okay, there we go. Okay. I need some things from the kitchen. and relax. I'll be back in a second. Now I'm back. Just a second. healing potion for you don't worry I'll be back in a second there is not a thing I need to take This is my special ingredient for the potion we make for you for your rest and recovery. You need to smell it. It's okay, just look around. I will prepare the potion for you. It's very special. Your potion now. I got some healing stones. to the 
forest tonight. There is a waterfall and it got some really healing waters and boiled it on the, over the fire. That's very important. It's for letting go so that you can relax tonight. So, we'll be ready in a second. This flower from my biggest travels ever which cost me a lot of energy in Africa and it will help you to get another strength at some of it That's ginger. It gives a nice taste. That should be enough. Mm, it smells so good. You will love it. And you can you will sleep perfectly. Fall asleep after 20 minutes around. Don't know, maybe earlier, because you're very tired. So now, I need to activate it with a spell. I will make you sleep. This potion. It's going, it's going to, to heal, heal my gut my gut from all this pain. pain from all this confusion and make and him, make him This will this make will you fall asleep, asleep very, very well. And now, now, please drink this. That's good. see you again. So if you just walk there, go upstairs, turn left, then walk straight, turn right, and then again left, and then you might be there. I'm not sure, maybe you ask somebody on your way again. There are a lot of people here walking around. Okay. So great that you feel a bit better and more calm now. And I hope I see you again. Bye. Take care.
Ausland.